guys, welcome to this video. I'm Jona Schindler and I want to show you how easy it is to create a very, very good looking website like this in WordPress. So I think this is a very, very good looking website and uh, it has very nice content, very nice features, very nice buttons, very nice text and it is very, very user friendly. This is also a very, very good looking website with a nice logo, with a nice menu with nice text and call to action buttons. And of course, also, this is a very, very, very nice looking website. So in this video, I want to show you that you can also create a WordPress website very, very quickly. And to convince you that WordPress is just so easy, I will go and create a very, very good looking website in just five minutes. Yes, you heard correctly. I will create a very good looking website in just five minutes. So just before we get started, I really want to recommend you this very good web hosting because you are going to need web hosting if you want to create your own website. SiteGround is a very, very good web hoster that I use for most of my projects, if not all of the projects. And why is uh, SiteGround such a very good hosting service? It's because they uh, are online for 24 hours a day. They're very, very quick. They're very, very caring. If you have any problems, you have very good support that is helpful 24 hours a day. You can live chat with them and they will deal with your problems right away. Usually they solve your problems within a couple of hours. Maximum it might take a day. If you need really good web hosting and if you don't have good web hosting, I really recommend you go to siteground.com and click on web hosting and you would start with the startup uh, package, which is plenty enough for one very, very good website. Okay, now I'm starting the five minute tutorial now and instead of registering for a new web hosting package, I will use my SiteGround web hosting package, which is this big one, and I'm going to log into my web hosting. So now the five minutes are going to get started and instead of, of course, creating a new domain, I will just install WordPress on a subdomain. All right, now let's get started with this five minute WordPress tutorial. I log into my hoster. Of course, my login details are already saved and I click on sign in. I go to my accounts and then I click on the C panel. Now SiteGround is a very cool hoster and it's also very easy to get through all of the settings. I will go and create a subdomain on jonaschindler.de and I will call it five minute. I'll call it the English title. 5minute.jonaschindler.de will be the domain name for my new WordPress website. So I click back to cPanel home and then I click here in auto installers on WordPress. And I'm going to install WordPress on my new subdomain. I click on this blue button here, install, and I choose the protocol HTTP and I will choose 5minute.jonaschindler.de. I leave the rest as it is, in, but I will also just quickly add some credentials here. I use a very safe password today uh, and I need to make sure it's actually the way I can remember it. The rest you can leave as it is. I will also leave the site language as English and I will install WordPress. Now this is going to be very, very quick already. 9%, 10% and in just a second WordPress is installed and I'm on my way to create a very, very good looking website in just five minutes. Okay, here we go. 100%, over 100% is installed. Okay, and we're ready to go. Now, so the website is already online and you can see there is some demo content which is not so pretty, but it doesn't matter. So we will log into our admin area, which is just our site name slash mm, WP minus admin and we're in our backend from WordPress. So the next thing that I want to do is install a very, very good looking premium theme. I go to themes and add new. Then I click on upload theme and choose a file. The file that I choose is called impresa.zip and I install it. It's get uploaded to my backend and it's already installed. So the next thing that we want to do is also install a child theme. So I again go to add new, upload theme, choose file, and then the Impresa child. 
Now, if you are interested in Impreza, then you can go to themeforest.net and search for Impreza, or you can, of course, also just use the links in my description or on this video. And here you can see the Impreza one license is $95, but it's very, very amazing. I can just show you how fantastic these, this theme is because of very flexible theme options and very, very good style. So I'm going to activate the chart theme. And here we go, we have Impreza installed. Clock is ticking, so I'm going to continue and go to add-ons and I'm going to install the Visual Composer plugin which comes with the Impreza theme and also the header builder. I will activate just right after I finish my amazing website. So the next thing that I'm going to do, by the way, the slider revolution is also included in the Impreza uh, theme and the next thing that I'm going to do to create a very very good looking website with Impreza is I'm going to install a demo. So I'll go to Impreza and demo import and I select the one page demo. I select all of this stuff and I click on import and now the demo import is going to be uh, the demo content is going to be imported and now the import is complete and I can have a look at my website and here we go, 5minute.jonaschindler.de. Have a look at this amazing website. It's ready. Now you have a very, very good looking menu. Here up there, there's the website name. You have a very nice title, some very, very cool buttons that uh, scroll down when you click on them. Here would be a portfolio. Uh, there is no portfolio, but or at least no images, but there is a portfolio. You have some nice search functionality, some nice sub menu, very nice colors, very nice effects. And when you scroll down, you have very nice icons, very nice text. And uh, yeah, at the very bottom, you have a very nice contact form, which is all there for you. Of course, this is demo content, but you are very free to just enter all your own information. So you could go to pages, um, add new pages or just use the existing home page and just edit all the content. Now this looks like gibberish so you have to click on backend editor and now it makes more sense. You have all these elements. This visual composer divides this whole content into rows. So you have different elements here. You can just click on this little pen and then this text window opens and you can just change the text. Now this was the very, very, very five minute, very short WordPress tutorial and I showed you just how easy WordPress is. Just five minutes you're able to create the whole framework of a very, very good looking website. Um, this just demonstrates how easy and how great WordPress is. And I'm very convinced even if you've never done it, you can create also a very, very good looking website. Of course, it's very helpful if you have a very good looking and very helpful and flexible theme like the Impreza. But honestly, there are many other good uh, premium themes outside. Just have a look or have a look at this theme. And uh, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial. Um, maybe you learned something and maybe you feel more comfortable to make your own website yourself. Of course, you will still need a couple of days to um, create content and to add your own text information and images, but just to have that very basic framework, it doesn't take more than five minutes. All right, guys, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more great WordPress videos. Most of my videos, of course, are in German, as you can see on my channel, but I will also continue to produce great English content. Take care, bye-bye.